You don't even understand what it means to be human. Get the hell away from me. Yeah, but like, this is my office. <clears throat> Morgan. Mm -hmm. Morgan. Mm -hmm. January has been showing me around, telling me, well, everything. Mm -hmm. I figured you came back because your ears were burning. The truth of that statement is <clears throat> questionable. On many levels, Chief Illusion. Hmm. Must be over here, January. Morgan, the coral is spreading to other parts of the station. Hmm. I doubt the Typhon are just going to keep I building it indefinitely. That. That was kind of weird. So I was like, is purpose. she mad at me now? Got stationed in engineering because paraplexes prevented me from being a pilot. Now all pilots what we need. Okay, I mean, I'm glad you're here then. Yeah, that was a confusing turn of events. I assumed she was going to, like, turn hostile or something. That's why I don't know why I kept my gun trained on her, honestly. I was like, if she goes up and starts throwing a bunch of psycho mods at me, I'm going to not be able to take this lady, probably. Pretty low on every. Uh, well, not very low on everything, but I'm. Uh, I don't really want to kill any friends if I can help it. I'm not trying to be. Oh, I forgot. There's something in here, by the way. I think. But eat these. Eat these. Using that trick we found. I think there's just like a mimic in here or something like that. I found this on one of my going back pieces where I was looking for screenshots and stuff. And we can't really do anything in here because it required the leverage, so let me try and find it. I think there's like one item. Looks like dirt. Med kit. You can tell it's early. You can tell it's the early part. Yeah, there we go. Emails. Hunter Hale, wait. What? Oh, mimic. Yeah, there it is. I was like, I know there's a mimic in here somewhere. Beef. Okay. So we need to go to the Neuromod Division. Has caught that. Eh, let's just go ahead and blow this up. I don't use these recyclers for like anything important. <laughs> I feel like I'm always just using them to clear paths. I don't even use them for like DPS or anything like that. Neuromod Division. Yeah, here we go. We gotta find the volunteer quarters. Hopefully the hopefully the actual thing will send us our direction we need to go. I don't think it will though, because we don't have an actual security lock on him. But just to fill you out, we're doing this so that we can get huh, can I get in here actually. You guys are all upstairs. So we're doing this so that we can get to the cook. So I think he, I, I have a feeling this guy is going to be like a thorn in our side until we defeat, until we beat him. Skill recorder analytics. Huh. How do I get in here? Can I get in this way? Nope. I'll just repair this. I don't really feel like going. I don't feel like doing the ladder strats anymore, and we got more than enough stuff. Try to get some sneak tacks. They don't do much, but they do hurt a bit more. Nothing that trash can good. That was not worth it. Now I'm fighting a long range battle with a long range foe. You shouldn't have closed the distance, sir. You had all the advantage and you threw it away. Oh, could I get the disruptor gun early? Jeez. I must have walked right over that. Volunteer services. Two, seven, five, eight. Give me in there. This is the first time I've ever, I've had to use this the entire game. Oh my gosh.
Makes sense this place is creepy. A lot of creepy stuff going on in here. This is where they were bringing the poor people who were subject to their experiments. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm all torn up about what to do in this game. It's like, do we, do we blow the station up? I mean, that's kind of a cover-up at that point, and I'm not really a fan of that. That course of action. Do we... Yeah, like, if we just blow it up, then that's just... That's basically just us covering up our past mistakes and misdeeds. But also, it's kind of like paying the price for it, I suppose. Even though it's kind of hard to pay a price for this sort of stuff. And then you got... All the people in the ship who are still alive... They're just gonna die, and they don't really know why. So that's kind of messed up. For obvious reasons. Or if the reasons aren't obvious, I shouldn't have to explain them to you. Wrench. The area you could probably get to if you... Save some ammo. It's been a while since we smacked the mimic with a wrench, actually. It's been quite a while. Fabrication. Body. Sounds like some robots. A technopath. Oh my gosh. No, please. It's getting through. It's getting through. No, get away from that stuff. I'd probably just let him in. All right, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna have to take care of this thing. I hate the the technopaths do so much damage too. Oh, it actually stuns them. That's cool. Ooh, stun gun coming in clutch. I had no idea. I wish I'd known that like hours ago. That I could stun those things with a stun gun. And stun gun is way more useful than I thought it was going to be. Fair? Nah. No reason to repair it. I'm not going to use it. Can I get in here? No key card. Any way to get up there? I can't climb this. Like weird. I wonder if like on harder difficulties or something like that, if you ever actually run out of glue. Ah, oh, damn it. <sighs> so like a baby shot, a fully charged shot, and a tiny shot will kill them completely. I think this is blocked in here. Kinda weird. Guess I can't pick anything up. Alden Graves' office. He must be important. They don't swivel. They don't swivel. Restricted access. Fabrication room. Storage. What is this? Doors are well, actors are wonky. Come see me if you need engraves. Heal scraps. A lot of uh odd material in there. So looking for Graves' office. We got a fabricator. Let's go ahead and make that. All right, recycler. I always get those two mixed up. If we do find a fabricator that would be sitting pretty. Wow, 
We're actually not in too bad a shape right now. This area is cool. There's a fabricator. Hmm, getting back to kind of an exploring aspect. I like it. I like it. Like a whole new area we have never actually seen before. Knowing that this guy is so close, I have a feeling this is going to be... No, it's not. This one's a little wonky, though. Touchpad is off. Yeah, y'all seen that. Touchpad's all weird here. I'm going to make the one. I don't want to use this one. Okay. So we are looking for operator Spencer's this way. Let's just go back the way we were for a second. Make sure that there's nothing crazy going on down here. This looks like a way down. Let's go back up. What is that mimic noise? We can get inside his office now, Mr. Halden Graves. Close this door. That is creepy as hell. Oh my gosh. About to go put a bullet in that body. <laughs> About to go put a bullet in that body just to make it stop looking. Hmm. Very strange. Knew something was wrong in this area. Scissors. It comes from them. Get it out now. Rails receptor modules. What is this? Listen to this. I can't find that open airlock. I think there's something following me. It's. I keep hearing it. That it doesn't make any sense. It's, it's just in my head. Ay, Mateo. David, I love you both. Mom, I'm sorry. I know you were just trying to protect me. I love you so much. Yeah. Ay, Dios santo. Hmm. Is another one in there? Hmm. Morgan, January was right. It was not you. But I keep hearing your voice and my father's voice. And it was not you. I know. You saved me because you wanted to. That is not the same person on the recording. Something's changed. I need to see that. I'm better now. I'll do what I can to get us off the station alive, but that log is coming with me. If you truly want forgiveness, you'll help me get it to where it belongs. No matter what that means for you and Tronstar. Listen to some checks. recordings now. Semlab secure. Oh, Igwe again. All except for Igwe, but he'll be up all night. Speaking of up, did you see the photos of his daughter Maya? But that's not his daughter. It's his wife. Are you kidding me? No, she died. Well, when Igwe was younger, it's in his records. Christ, you've seen his records? Yeah, during the security checks, looking for those red flag sykes that the brass is up in arms about. Apparently, came home, found her dead on the floor. Aneurysm. Spend your life studying the brain. The brain takes its toll. With everything else going on at the time, with the shaming... Christ. You already said that, but I don't think he heard you. He's not looking at this station, that's for sure. Hmm. Alex. There's a lot more of these than out. previously. It's too late. Graves. Are you still in fabrication? There we go. The receptor Graves. molecules. The exotic neurotransmitters. We didn't synthesize them. And there's no terrestrial source. Graves, don't do anything drastic. You know me. You know I always have a contingency plan. We've been shoving it into our skulls. It all comes from them. But you, you never... I'm going to send someone to help you. I need to get this out now. Oh, 
God, but the neuromods, they can still be fabricated. Graves, do not touch the neuromod licenses. Do you hear me? Oh, so he was like trying to... He was trying to revoke everyone's files. I'm going to reload this area. I think it's busted. Everything's kind of like blocked. I can't move anything around here. So you guys will see if I can fix this area. We'll see how that works in a second. Okay, it looks like that fixed things. So let's see. He was trying to revoke everyone's fabrication licenses. He must have figured out that the... He must have figured out that the neuromods were bad, so you may continue doing them under the current license utilities. Unlock the fabrication doors. That's that's my door. <laughs> oh, the fabrication doors. Exotic materials, where does it come from? Missing neuromods. E4, 4, four sign 4. Okay, so we can get down to that area down there now. Get all the extra stuff. Get that. Mm, it was this way, I think. So it says I'm down here and that there should be in the... Oh, it's in the restricted area, probably. Heard that stinger, too. I'll know something's down there. All right. Let's put our big boy pants on. Get fumigated. Oh, this isn't even working. Oh, wait a minute. Fabrication. This is the right area. Let's look. All right, yeah, the volunteer quarters is there. Okay, so we did get turned upside down. Then what we got over here? More volunteer testing. Error with the key code. Let's go ahead and hack it. Oh, started us in an actually not bad place. Okay. So this place is going to be dark as all sin, too. No. Okay. Hello, Mimic. Goodbye, Mimic. I wonder if that's a voltaic. Yeah, it is. Port teleports over. That's ah, putting mimics on us. Yeah, I could use like a little bit more shotgun damage, but I know that there's no more in the whole game. <laughs> oh, just a little bit more. Come on. Let me just put some knives on the end of it or something like that. Ooh. There, he's creepy. Get back here. I feel like just rambo in half the time on these guys. I'm just running around, blowing them up. That could pop. Be careful of that. Surprise. Didn't even see me coming. Never see him coming. This must be locked. Yeah. Oh, is this to that place I couldn't get to? Skill recorder analysis. Can I get in here now? Let's look and see. Man, it's like a place we saw at the very beginning of the game. It's like just now able to get to it. That's really cool. That is a... This, I'll tell you something about this game. This game has great level design. I think this is like one of the only games I've really felt like they really planned everything out when they really came down to it. All right, I can get in there. Yeah, if you had come in this area really early on, somehow, you would have, you probably could have gotten in here, actually. Yeah, if you could have gotten in here somehow, it would have been, like, 
run, run, run. All right. So this is like when they bring people to check how the neuromods are affecting them. Skeleton. No password. I can hack it. Was there anything in here, though? Or is it just that enemy? Oof. Bouncy. My fingers are getting a little cold, so it's kind of like... Cold as hell outside, too, so... That's my excuse. What's his email say? Another decontamination exercise. What do you think they found? That wasn't really worth the hacking time. <laughs> Just talking about what we think is going to happen. Beautiful. I get Igwe in here, play me some, play me a concerto. This seemed extremely pointless. Exceedingly so. There's a body. So I did realize when I was going through the security console, what you can do is if you want to find all the bodies in the game, like account for everyone, you can actually just toggle a body. That's like what I did with, um, what's her name? That's what I did with Danielle, just so I can make sure I keep tabs on her. And so I don't get completely lost away from her if it makes me go find her eventually. Match the phrase in English with that in Mandarin. They must be checking more people. So you can go and find all the bodies in the game if you really want to. It's kind of cool you can do that even. I feel like at this point in the game we're like so over leveled. There must be a poltergeist in here. Some random neuromod. I'll take it. half expecting there to be some sort of trap. I feel like I'm getting really close to this dude and I haven't seen any traps in a while. I'm assuming I'm gonna get, like, run into a giant gauntlet of them eventually. Oh, it'd be cool if I could like take all my neuromods out. It'd be kind of useless but like it would be neat because this is the chairs they use to like put them in and extract them I think. So I'm probably very used to those by now. Neural scan, perform neural scan, age surgical harness, debrief. Let's do that. Oh no patient. No patient. Hello, volunteer. Hmm. My name is Bianca Goodwin. I'm the volunteer and guest liaison aboard Talos One. I wanted to be the first person to congratulate. Oh man, this is the guy we were looking at. On behalf he got like hundred percent like everything. Dude's well like super done, high up thank there. You. I'm sure you feel disoriented. This is because you've just experienced a medical procedure known as apto-regressive neurotomy. For the next few hours, you might have trouble with fine motor skills or you call it... Insulation extraction. So that's the, where, where they took them, if they needed to take neuromods out of them or put them into them. Like a controlled testing area. This company is so Maybe creepy, though. You think about it, it's like they're jamming... Like just jamming Please, memories and enough. thoughts in your brain. Once you feel well enough, That's just I'll come by to weird, your you know what I mean? Interview. Like See even soon. even the people who you who are like making like the best point for why this is okay, many of them are just as corrupt as all the other ones. It's not even like there's anybody you can really lean on in the story. It's like Michaela's probably the closest one to having like a real person that we've met so far who's not just like kind of a scumbag. I mean, Igwe is, I don't know if Igwe is or not, I can't really, I can't really tell, but Igwe is like stealing stuff and making his own mods and stuff like that. That's not really cool. If we're going by company rules, I suppose. And then you got Michaela's Morgan himself is, like, is subjecting like people to... Pretty horrific experiments, honestly. And I like how it's, I don't like, but it's uh, interesting how you can tell they dehumanize them by giving them numbers instead of names. That's a, not a trick I would say, but that's like something I've definitely heard about. 
easier to say number 0044. Oh my gosh. <laughs> took the took the cup. <laughs> took the cup, shot the shot the brownies off the table. I love it. All right, jelly deals or whatever you are. Come here. Come over with me. All right, so what are we looking for in here? Right now we're just looking for creepy stuff. Habitation pods. I could open that potentially. Not gonna go off. Restricted. I get in here. This is like the medical area. Now our flashlight does have a limited counter. So the light could just go off randomly. We could hang out here for a second. All right, why would you do that right in front of me? What is this? Got some bodies. Looks no contrabandist. I don't know. Oh, he's blackmailing people. Huh. John Haskins. Like an actual employee here. They must have been part of the security detail or something like that. That wrench. Need the inorganic. Critical. We're at critical mass. Oh my gosh. At least my, at least my trigger is getting a bit... My quick trigger is getting a bit easier. Uh, can I turn this off for a second? Let it re recharge. I think I have a mod for... Oh. Can I turn all this on? The floor is electric now. We kind of learned this trick already. Is it just literally the whole entire floor is lava? I don't want to just die. Is the whole floor lava? Golly day. That's not good. This doesn't look like lava. Okay, cool. So everything should be online now. Golly day. Where are you, Mimic? Stay put. Let's check this one. Alright, I beat on it for a minute. <laughs> Nothing pop out, so I'm gonna assume we're good. More habitation area stuff. They had a lot of people on this ship. A lot of people on this ship. A lot of people didn't make it too. I'm almost out of shotgun, man. I need to calm down on that. What's in here? Poltergeist. Yeah, poltergeist. Oh. I think there's one more in here. Now everything's turned on, so at least we can get where we need to go. We've already been in here, I believe. Yeah, we did. It was dark, so it was hard to tell where we were going. All right, crew. Who are we looking for? You're looking for number 37. So this guy. Get him. He's the only one left alive, too. We can finish exploring this area a little bit. Now the lights are on, we don't have to drain our battery. That was cool though, that was the only only area in the entire game where we've had to use our flashlight so far. <laughs> That's so weird. I would assume they'd have more of that. Oh, I mean, I was standing way too close to that. Take a break. Oh, I thought that was supposed to break those. Nope, I guess not. Okay, well, I guess that's it for this area. I didn't get an actual map, but I filled it out pretty good. That area is electrocuted. Security station. Alright, that's pretty much the whole Neuromod division area done. Alright, so we need to do something real quick. For our objectives, this guy, Talos 1 Bridge. So he's on the bridge. That's up in the Arboretum. We can get there from the Arboretum, so we're headed there for sure. Let's get this guy. And we gotta be extra careful for traps, though, I think. 
I would assume if I was that dude that I'd be I would already know that Mr. Yu knew where I was going where I was. I would not want to take any chances at this point. I think what is this wavering relationships? Some random information about John F. Kennedy. <laughs> okay. Appreciate it, game. All right, Grant Lockwood. Is he in here too? All I need to do is get to the... Oof. Nightmare again? Again with this man. Sir. Are, are you being serious, sir? Hmm. You know, I could just get on the... Coming up the steps. Yeah, he is. Look at him. I didn't go up the steps. So proud of my big boy. Oh, the, oh, it's not here. Oh, the elevator. The elevator's not here, shit. 19, 19, 1980 to 1990, 2025. The Trans 2030. Talos 1 becomes fully operative. 2020, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, Oh my gosh. Nightmare is on my butt all the time now. Ridiculous. All the time, every two minutes. Alright. Arboretum. Let's get it. He's probably stuck. The. I would assume the nightmare is stuck at this point. I can't imagine that he's he's able to get out of there. We've already covered the bridge. I I, I jump so far ahead in half these areas. If you're if you guys are playing this game, I would recommend that you pretty much just go with the story and try and pick up stuff along the way. Because from what I've gotten everywhere that I've gone before, I'm just having to go Use backwards. My to upload the data. I'll get it integrated oh, into the fabrication down. plan for the new null wave device as fast as possible. And be careful. The Typhoon will begin to sense our intent to harm the Coral. They're gonna come after you. I left something for you on my desk that should help. Alright. Down to the bridge. Let us go and find... Mr. Wants to be M.U. Get some blood. Hope that's not Danielle's blood. All right, where are you? <laughs> He's down below. How many people did you kill on your way out of here? I can snipe that. No, he ran away. Where was he? Oh, he was in the escape pods? All right. I'm waiting. There's gonna be a trap, you know it. He's just in one of the escape pods. Blood. Hey, Mr. Mitchell. Morgan, you. <coughs> this pod will work. We are over. Oh, Join. Damn it. Uh. <laughs> okay, I I didn't think. Okay, 
I did not think that that thing would just kill him. I don't know why I didn't think that. Morgan, you. Listen to him. <coughs> this pod will work, but I do not know how to launch it. Hmm. I think he's actually gonna. Let's resolve our conflict on Earth. In the fresh air, huh? With war. We are over now. <laughs> <laughs> I just dis I disarmed it, sir. Oh, he dies anyway. Okay. Did I technically kill him? Yeah, I got him. He's dead. I like the first outcome better. Honestly. <laughs> Oh, double tap, make sure you're dead. Make sure you're dead. All right, cool. Here, you come with me. You're not getting off this station. You're not getting off this station, I'm sorry, sure. You're gonna chill out here. You can splay yourself out for the, for the Typhons and all that good stuff. All right, well, there we go. One of our main objective side quests we wanted to do has now been completed. I don't think I can find Grant. I don't really care about this. I don't really care about this. I don't care about this. I don't care about this either. All right, so that's pretty much all the stuff I wanted to do. So, all right, cool. We can go ahead and move on with the main story now. Look at us go, Mr. Cook. No more.